What does ego have to do with conspiracy theories? Actually, it's what fuels every conspiracy theory. I'll explain. In my last video, I talked about three reasons why people believe conspiracy theories. One is when there's a lack of information, a conspiracy theory fills in that missing gap of knowledge. Two is when something causes anxiety, a conspiracy theory helps you predict where that threat is coming from, so it doesn't feel so random. Three is wanting to follow your in-group, so if your political party or whatever believes a conspiracy, then you are more likely to believe it. And the fourth reason is ego. People who believe conspiracy theories believe they are in a special group of independent thinkers who know the truth. They think they have a superior knowledge, while the majority of people are just sheep who are foolishly gullible and easily manipulated. And who wouldn't want to feel special? Let's start with an easy example. Imagine someone who wasn't particularly successful in school or their career. So deep down, their ego feels inferior. But if they believe the conspiracy theorists, well, now they feel like they're smarter than most others, and a small group of people will tell them so. Or let's imagine someone who is well-educated and has a professional career, like a doctor. We've seen a few doctors take fringe positions against vaccines and masks, so why would they do that? Same reason, ego. Maybe before, they felt like they weren't achieving the career success and recognition that they felt they deserved. But by supporting a fringe conspiracy theory, suddenly they're invited to give their expert testimony, and their faces on national cable, and a group of people are praising them as brilliant heroes. It is tempting, and for many people, that praise and special feeling is worth the trade-off of other people ridiculing and insulting them. In fact, this ego boost is so important, it's the only common root of all conspiracy theories. The other three reasons help to spread conspiracy theories, but they're not required. For example, is there any lack of information that the Earth is round? No, we have centuries of evidence. Is there any cause for anxiety? Nope, a round Earth is no threat to anyone. Is there an in-group that believes this? Nope, at least not in our lifetime. But flat earthers do believe they have a special superior knowledge, so it boosts their ego. This is also true for the moon landing was faked, or the government is covering up UFOs, and crackpot theories like the theory of relativity is wrong, because deep down they just want to feel smarter than Einstein. Okay, so what do we do with this information? How do you talk someone out of a conspiracy theory? For that, see my next video.